<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica Yik, and here's Nathaniel and Baba. Say hi. Hi. Today we're doing another grocery haul, and today's a little bit different because guess what? I sent Nelson out for groceries. Well, didn't send him out. He just went out for groceries, and uh, he came back with lots of surprises. And so let me know in the comments below before we get started on this. When you send out your significant other, and you're normally the person who goes out for groceries, are you presented with tons of surprises? Because that's what happened today. It's nothing bad. I mean, it's just, keeps things kind of exciting. And just now I have to kind of plan out dinners and things like that. So um, today's haul is from the Canadian Superstore and also from TNT, which is more like an Asian grocery store that we have up our way. Let's get into this. It's been about two weeks since our last grocery haul, just a little bit under actually, but because um, we're expecting a big storm coming in for the next few days, so we figured we'd nip it in the bud, go out and get some stuff. And this is all the wonderful goodies that dear daddy brought home. So I don't really know what's from what really i have an idea but we're just gonna go and make it one big huge haul daddy came home with some instant noodles but i'm gonna assume that the instant noodles are for the care package he's planning on sending one of his co-workers because he has never had the nissan or the nongshim uh, instant noodles and they're working really late nights lately working on programs and stuff so i'm guessing that's what it is he also came home with these and they are these for us or are these for for your friend for moi Okay, well, but we already have some, just so you know. No, this is a flat one. Oh, okay, that's different because these are flat. But these are really good, guys. If you've never had the Phoenix no, egg rolls, they are really yummy. Um, I did ask him to pick up fruit like oranges, so he did bring up a bag of oranges and bananas. I'm really happy about the size of bananas so that Nathaniel and Ginevra can eat them. I just find that when they're too big, it just doesn't make any sense because they become very wasteful. He also picked up a pack of surprise dumplings. My mom has actually been surprising us with, well, not surprising, but supplying us with homemade dumplings, but I guess he wanted some dumplings with shrimp in it, so therefore we have some shrimp dumplings so that he and Jennifer can share some shrimp dumplings. Um, I did ask him for some tofu because I love tofu in our cooking every now and then. Um, you can either stir fry these or if you press out the excessive water, but these are the medium firm, but if you get the firm ones, you can press out the excessive water and you might be able to do it with these ones um, and make a penko crust stick them in the oven and they are amazing they like it's just like the, I, I think they're called tonkatsus but anyways they're just really yummy he also surprised me with fish i walked into the kitchen i was like i smell fish and voila it's fish so <laughs> janeva was really excited because she loves fish mommy's allergic to most seafood but i can have fish and this is what kind of fish is this Haddock. Ooh, haddock's good. So we're going to have some fish tonight. You're going to also hear Nathaniel. He just He's in this phase right now where he constantly wants to be held. Oh, by the way, do you guys like this lip color? This lip color is the berry powder by the face shop um, collaboration with Avon Canada. And then on top of it, I just put a quick layer of the Blossom Pink VDL Lip Cube. And oh my gosh, I love this combination because it's really moisturizing. It's just enough shine. And it's, I just think it looks really pretty in summary. Continuing on with this haul. We also have here a bag of carrots. I use carrots a lot a lot in my cooking, so that works out. And yes, you're going to see our computer monitors here. We have migrated our office to temporarily be in our kitchen. I was so sad because we had it so nice and clean. And now we have all our monitors down here just so that we can be down here together and tag team working with the kids, especially when Ginevra starts like more of her online learning come September. He also bought some more compostable green bin layers liners. I bought the wrong kind last time, so that's that. Uh, we He also picked up some more produce, including some broccoli, and I believe those are probably from the Superstore. Am I correct? Because I remember seeing them in the fly for like 99 cents a pound or something like that. No? Where'd you get these? You got these from TNT? How much were they? Oh my god, you pay too much. Is that the Canadian Superstore? They're on for 99 cents a pound right now. Pounds? Yeah. Mm, that's okay, whatever. Uh, also, he loved these peanuts. They're roasted in shell nuts. They're just really yummy to snack on. Uh, mindless eating during late night coding. Uh, Shanghai bok choy. These are fantastic in quick braises and stir fries. We cook these a lot. Also really good with dumplings. Um, this is a surprise. The Oreo Delight. Did you buy it because it's Oreo or? Yeah. Cool. Oreo Delight. I didn't see that one. No, I've never seen it either. So, hey, let's try this one out. I really like the butter pecan one that we talked about last time. That was really good. So, um, I'm interested to try the next ones. Right now, the coffee we're drinking is Kicking Horse Three Sisters. It's darker than the Ethical Bean Lush one that we had last time. But it's, it's still also really yummy. I'm so torn. So many yummy coffees. 
only so much caffeine intake I could take. Moving on, we got he got a thing of white, uh, not white bread. He got a thing of whole wheat wonder bread. I do make my own bread, but sandwich breads is easier if we have this. And then these were also a surprise. Ritz crackers. The main reason to go out this time was, of course, milk. We have enough milk to probably last us for the rest of this week, but I always want to have milk on hand since Jenna never does drink it every day. And then these were also a surprise. These little puffs. We have. We need food. I know, but not puffs, like yogurt, prunes, and oatmeal. Yeah, but we're almost done with that thing. Yeah, we have six more really? in the pantry. Yeah, uh, that's okay. But they're different flavors. I mean, he hasn't had the banana flavored um, yeah, or sweet potato. Yeah, our son loves to eat, but the sweet potato flavor is different. Uh, but he's had the strawberry apple one. He does like it. He just go he goes through these a lot, so it's fine. Whatever, he'll end up eating them. Another thing that I need Nelson to go out for, which are the uh, breakfast cereals for him: wheat and oat, oatmeal, wheat and oat, multigrain. Oh, good. There's a variety, which is nice. He has these in the morning, so it's 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 just easy and fast, to, especially when I'm like half asleep. Now, this I thought was absolutely hilarious. Um, I did ask him to pick up a few pouches of prunes and maybe some yogurt, but he came back with tons and tons of goodies for his boy. So he has, what, two, four, 15 pouches, mix of um, different types of yogurt, strange baby fruit, but the most important thing are the prunes because that Nathaniel still needs some assistance in the fiber department. But hey, apple and cherry, nice. But I mean, like, and he... He eats these with his meals as a dessert, so it's good. But this part was the most hilarious thing. I did say get some applesauce because Nathaniel loves applesauce. And he didn't come home with one or two. He came home with six. They're on sale. Oh, are they? We can use them for something. If anything, I can make muffins out of this. So that we is... will finish one... In, in a, a week. I know. Week and a half. That's true. He loves his applesauce. So that's it for this haul, guys. Quick, fast haul. Lots of goodies, and I don't even want to know how much. I feel like you probably paid more than 100 bucks for this. Well, this is 90 something. Oh, just from World Canadian? Okay, and how much did you pay at TNT? 30? Roughly $120 for this haul. Not, not. Not great, considering my last haul was like 50 bucks, 57 bucks. But that's okay. I mean, they have some necessities. And I mean, literally, grocery shopping is our form of entertainment now. So that's it. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification on this channel. I upload as often as I can. I have no upload schedule. If you want to see more content made by me. Feel free to jump over also to my The Dancing Avon Lady channel where I talk about beauty reviews, business tips, and also dance adventures when I can dance again. If you enjoy haul videos, make sure you let me know by giving me a big fat thumbs up. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!